introduction to long and short objects hello friends i am a parrot and i welcome you to this lesson today in this lesson you will learn how to identify the long object and the short object out of two objects today is sunday and pinky and her mother have gone to the garden for a walk mummy look at that plant all of its leaves are different yes pinky come let's go closer and look at it mummy look at these two leaves they both are different yes pinky the length of both of these leaves is different out of these two leaves this leaf is long and this leaf is short you see this yes mummy this means that out of these two this is the long leaf and this is the short leaf yes pinky you're absolutely right mummy look at that chili plant even in this the length of both the chilies is different out of these two chilies this chili is long and this chili is short right yes pinky you understood correctly now look around and give me another example of a long object and a short object can you do that mm mummy please look at these two sticks out of these this stick is long and this stick is short right yes pinky very good now let's go home so kids can you also identify the long object and the short object out of two objects come let's see these are two pencils now tell me out of these two which one is the long pencil and which one is the short pencil yes out of these two this pencil is long and this pencil is short even you had the same answer right great so kids you enjoyed comparing the length of objects right Now you also compare the length of objects around you and tell which is the long object and which is the short object That is all for today In this video we learned how to identify the long object and the short object out of two objects In the next video we will see some more interesting examples of identifying long and short objects Till then bye bye friends Examples of long and short objects Kids in the previous video you learned how to identify the long object and the short object out of two objects in this video we will identify the longest object and the shortest object out of three objects today is a school holiday for chotu and pinky they are both sitting outside their house and playing with their toy cars chotu can you tell me out of all these cars that are kept here Which one is the longest out of these? This car is the longest. Isn't it, Pinky? Yes, Chotu. Out of these three cars, this one is the longest car. And out of these, which is the shortest car, Chotu? This car is the shortest, right? Yes, Chotu. You are absolutely right. Out of these three cars, this one is the longest car, and this is the shortest car. See, over there, 
papa's mummy's and your slippers are kept can you tell me out of these three whose slippers are the longest yes pinky papa's slippers are the longest yes chotu and out of these three whose slippers are the shortest my slippers are the shortest pinky yes chotu you are absolutely right this means that out of the three slippers papa has the longest slippers and you have the shortest slippers come on now let's play chotu so kids now you can also identify the longest object and the shortest object out of three objects like chotu come let's see these are three chocolates can you tell me which is the longest chocolate out of these yes this chocolate is the longest and which is the shortest chocolate out of these three yes this chocolate is the shortest this means that out of these three chocolates this is the longest chocolate and this is the shortest chocolate that is all for today in this video we identified the longest object and the shortest objects out of three objects so in the next video we will see some common mistakes in identifying long and short objects till then bye bye friends mistakes in identification of long and short objects so kids in the previous video you identified the longest object and the shortest object out of three objects so friends in this video we will learn about some common mistakes in identifying long and short objects Chotu and his mother have sat down to have their food. Chotu, can you please give me a spoon please? Which spoon, mummy? The short one or the long one? <laughs> Chotu, both these spoons are of the same length. Neither of them is short or long. No, mummy. See, this spoon is long and this spoon is short. <laughs> oh no, Chotu. This spoon looks longer to you because it is placed a little ahead. Keep both the spoons together so that one end of both the spoons is together. Okay, mummy. Here you go. Now tell me, out of these two spoons, is either of them long or short or both the spoons are of the same length? Tell me. Oh, yes, mummy. Both of them are of the same length. Understood. Now, see the three keys kept near you, Chotu. One is my room key, one is your room key, and one is the house key. Now, can you tell me, Chotu, which of the three keys is the longest key and which key is the shortest key? By looking at them, it seems like this key is the longest. and this key is the shortest but before answering your question mummy i will keep all the three keys together so that one end of all the three keys is together okay chotu now tell me now if we look at all the three keys the length of all three is the same that's why neither of them is long or short isn't it mummy Yes, Chotu. Very good. So, kids, now you also won't make a mistake in comparing the length of two or more objects like Chotu, right, friends? Always remember that before comparing the length of objects, first we should keep the objects together 
so that one end of all the objects is together and then the lengths of these objects should be compared. That's all for today. In these videos, we learned how to compare the length of two or more objects. I hope that you have understood this topic very well friends. Bye-bye.